Welcome to Group 8's presentation of We Are Assigned Assignment 1. Group 8 consists of Cham Jo An, Wong Xin Chi, and Zurita Zakaria. Today, we would like to present our title for the assignment, which is ASIC, ASSP, and SOC. First, let's look at ASIC. ASIC stands for Application Specific Integrated Circuit, a non-standard integrated IC customized for specific function. For example, IC in certain electronic products by a manufacturer that are designed to be used only by products produced by the same manufacturer. This means that they require high cost to design, but it may help to reduce cost, for example, in manufacturing specific product in high volume where demand on the product is high. As ASIC can be designed to meet specific purpose, the size of the overall design of product can be reduced as additional component is reduced. ASIC are usually classified into three categories, full custom, semi-custom and structure. First, let's look at full custom. Full custom is the most flexible as ASIC can be designed down to transistor level. However, the risk is high as the design is untested and not built for available library sources. These are time consuming and require high cost. ASIC are tailored from the start of the designing process to a specific purpose that leave no alternative to alter or change the circuit during fabrication except for maybe some minor tuning or calibration. This means that full custom ASIC is produced as a single application product. Unlike full custom, semi custom or standard cell ASIC can be customized to fulfill different tasks within this applicable general area. It is designed to accept certain level of modification as it is built up from previously available library sources. This is flexible if standard function able to meet the requirement. Lastly, the structure or gate array ASIC are designed intended to shorten design cycle and minimize cost, but it is the least flexible. The silicon layers are standard but metallization layers allowing interconnection between areas on chip are customized. The platform is built from a group of platform slices meaning pre-manufactured device, system or logic. Each slice can be customized by varying the metal layers. This means that the platform for new design is not built from scratch. In conclusion, ASIC first application is limited to logic functions but now mixed signal ASIC design includes analog and logic function. Mixed signal is useful in making complete system on chip SOC where a complete system is integrated in the chip without requiring any other component. Among ASIC application are IC for specific function within a particular automation system. For example, in a factory amplifier IC designed for specific purpose, that cannot be done by standard amplifier product. Next, we will talk about ASSP. ASSP or Application Specific Standard Product is a semiconductor device integrated circuit product that implements a specific function that appeals to a wide market. Like an ASIC, the ASSP is also for a special application. However, it is sold to a number of companies unlike ASIC where it is designed and built to order for a specific company only. In other words, it is available as off-the-shelf components to multiple customers and hence the term standard product. Generally, an ASSP offers the same performance characteristics and has the same die size as an ASIC. ASSP are used in various types of industries from automotive to communications. Some examples of ASSP are integrated circuits that perform video and audio encoding and decoding. Lastly, let's talk about SOC, which stands for System on a Chip. What is SOC? SOC are packaging of all necessary electronic circuits and parts for a system, for example, cell phone or digital camera. SOC is also known as microchip used in small, increasingly complex electronic devices. The figure shows example of SOC components in an MP3 player. In conclusion, SOC are self-evident where the smaller is the better devices. Uniqueness of SOC is it is software and hardware.